So this is called the falling series, okay? So the person is going to push you, and we're going to end up on the ground here. And it really matters. We've got two fighting stances on the ground. We've got this tank position for uh, this is called cannon. Boom! That's our cannon kick. And then we can fall and, and tank. This is our tank kick when our leg, leg is right here on the ground. And I'm going, I can kick that way as well. We're going to use those two positions. Okay? And what's important about this, uh, these techniques, is they're pretty ambidextrous. Whatever I use, Whatever I use, whatever technique I use, it, it's, it, can, it can work either way. All right, and I'll do a demonstration of that right now. So if he pushes me down, the first technique is he's going to walk forward with his right leg in front. I'm going to hook with my Achilles. That's the most important part because we're in this stance. You know, we're in this, in, the, in this cannon stance. So i got to hook here with the Achilles, and I do checking kick that way. Bam. Good. That's with his right leg. I stand up, and I punch. Boom. And I run out of here. I run to safety. Next one is, is this could count as number two, but not on the test. I just want to show how it's ambidextrous. If he pushes me, okay, and he steps forward with his other leg, okay, I can hook behind that leg and do the same technique. Okay, all right, so it's important that you just, that, that the movement of this, that being the movement, that's, that's the important part. And then next one we can get away with, with being, uh, with having them count as two different ones um, on the test. So if he pushes me, if he steps forward with his right leg, I fall in tank position. I'm going to hook his front leg here, just with my toes, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hit the back of his knee, and we're going to roll this way. My foot's going to pop out, okay, and I'm going to kick. Bam. He can hold on tight, but it's only going to make my foot fly out faster. Now, the next one, as if he steps forward with the other leg. I can get away with it on the brown ball test because it's a really opposite technique. It's pretty different. So he steps forward with the, uh, the uh, is that your right leg? Left. left leg? Oh, we might have to cut. Good. I'm gonna do, the, I'm gonna fall on my left side, the same side again, okay? I'm not changing the side. So I'm gonna do the same thing, but to the left leg that's forward. And this time, this is called figure four, which it bends the knee this way. Just like so. It can be uncomfortable. Bam. All right, that's just my to immobilize them. We're going to go into crap stance and then axe kick and then run. Okay, good. So those are those two, two techniques that, that, we can, that we can count as two different ones. Depending on which leg is forward, it doesn't matter. And I can fall on either side, just as long as I, do, as I know the technique. Uh, the technique of scissoring. So he steps forward with any leg. If I, if I already know what I'm going to do, bam, I can do it the opposite way. Okay? Or if he steps forward with the other leg. Okay? Oh, already there, good. I can just do this one. As long as I recognize the movements. Okay? Bam. Right? Good. So, last one, uh, which is pretty opposite than those two series, than, than those first, the second and third one. Is, is falling and then getting up. We're gonna fall into tank. So he pushes me, I fall on my side. He's still gonna attack. This foot goes down, okay? And then I'm gonna kick with this leg, the leg that's on the floor. I'm gonna get up and I'm gonna kick. Bam! I'm gonna run away, okay? Good, good. So he pushes me, okay? I have to do it kind of quick. He's coming at me fast. Bam! I'm gonna run away. Usually it's acting like possum. I want to scoot back a little bit more. So he pushes me, and he knows maybe I can't, he can't attack me like this. I can just kick him. Scoot back, scoot back, oh, I'm going to kick you. Okay? All right? But he's going to come at me as soon as I start going, oh, oh. And I know I can kick from there. Okay? Good. That's the possum one. All right. Excellent. So let's put them all together. All right? So let's dance bow. First one. He pushes me. I fall down. He sits forward with his right knee. I'm going to hook it. He goes down. I stand up and I put hit it. And then fight stance. Good. And then he pushes me again. He's going to step forward with his right leg. I'm going to go. I'm going to land on my left side. And then I'm going to twist with this. Back of the knee. Hit this way. And then kick the back of his leg. Hit it. And then run. Next, he steps forward with the other leg. Same technique, but it ends up with a different outcome. He steps forward with the left leg. I hook the, the knee, I'm on my side, I twist, and I get up, axe kick, and then body stance. 
Next one, the fourth one, is the possum one. He kicked, forcing me back. I land on my left side. He might take a while coming up. Okay? But then when I act like a possum, oh, I'm hurt. Bam. Okay? Let me do that one one more time. He pushes me. I fall down. Put this leg down, and then bam. All right. Let's do all of them. Hang in there with no talking. Okay? The first one, he pushes. He sits forward. Ah! I should. Uh, next one. Number two. Right leg forward. Left foot on your left side. Excellent. 